Amanda was, um, she was, a, she was a spirited child and I always knew that from the time she was born. She didn't sleep right, she didn't eat right. And um, I never really had a sign that she was depressed. It was only when she reached um, probably age 13 and up. And so here's a child who looked, walked and talked normal, but had lots of stuff internally. Not a whole lot that came out until later. So as school gets more challenging, the anxieties become um, increased. So we talk about some inappropriate type behaviors that appear that other people take as attention seeking or bad. And as all these things compiled, Amanda found online was better than peer to peer because she wasn't as judged. However, she made some bad choices online, which started that whole snowball effect of um, Amanda's story. she would give me signs like well we would fight and she'd say I'm just gonna go and kill myself right and so those I think are the very first signs when kids actually are, are threatening and even if they don't mean it they're thinking about it so those were the telltale things for me that I needed to to act on she just told me all the things that she felt however initially you don't I don't know if I believed her totally, you know, it's like, oh, just come out and get over it. And we would say those typical things, but now, knowing now what I didn't know then, those things make kids feel so much worse. It, it's been quite a journey, learning about mental health, learning about suicide. Um, one of the big things that I found was that it's a topic that no one wants to talk about. In order to get the preventions, the awareness, the interventions, the resources, we have to make it, um, we have to make people aware out there that this is a social issue. It is a problem. It affects lives. And so basically the suicide stuff is life or death. And I think the kind of services and programs that could have helped Amanda would be to have increased support groups for um, youth that are in need of help and also having more affordable psychologist care, mental health care in, in community services. People can support the Right By You campaign by going to the website and signing the petition and then going to governments to make sure that the resources are in place.